All right, we're back with part three of anime hot takes from Japanese people from Mr. Takashi's channel. Frieza was pretty based here. Let's see what see some of the other contestants have to say. <laughs> I just love all the Jujutsu Kaisen. I don't know what I like more. The Jujutsu Kaisen slander, the Demon Slayer slander, or like Oshinoko slander. Yeah. What? Whoa. Whoa. Detective Conan is getting stray bullets right now? Why? It's, it's an anime that shows a lot of blood. You need more of logic than that. Yeah. What? So you couldn't handle a little bit of blood when you were a kid? So Detective Conan, one of the all-time greats, is overrated? Sounds like a fucking skill issue, bitch! なんか見なくなりました。弱い。個人的に好きだけど、まあもっと人気出てもいいってやつ。ハイキュです。おお、ハイキュー。and just like every other popular anime that every other YouTube reaction channel pops off of, I can never, you know, watch it because you motherfuckers just don't care about this show, huh? Exactly, that's the thing. If you actually play, you know, sports, then like people are gonna do that. Another monkey coming in first time chatting has no understanding of what the fuck August 4th PST means. It's just actually insane. There's gonna be more retards coming in during this stream, I guarantee you. They have no understanding of time zones. I give you everything and you still don't fucking know. Genuinely, you don't deserve my content. Genuinely, you do not. If I was dictator of the world, I would make sure people like you couldn't vote. It's dangerous to have people like you around. Ooh. This girl said Detective Conan is overrated and Tokyo Revengers is underrated. The one with Taki Bichi. Isn't this such a trash? That's like saying Spongebob is your favorite, right? That's, that, that's all right. I don't think that's a hot take. Yeah, yeah these are like children's all-time favorite. But I guess that like she just like, you know, Doraemon, Detective Conan, they are both like children's kind of shows you're growing up, but I guess too much bloody on Conan and she prefers Doraemon. It makes sense. <laughs> ノビタとドラえもんっていうその仲いいキャラクターがすごく可愛くてずっと大好きなのでずっと見てます。人気だけど個人的にあんまりっていうアニメありますか？イケメン。いつの刃。おほほほ。Mr.イケメンへ。What
。オールタイムベスト教えてください。ハイキューです。おお、another ハイキュー mention。I'm telling you, there is such a big community for like ハイキュー enjoyers. Like, I've seen anime reaction channels that only do ハイキュー and just get like hundreds of thousands of views. But that was back when it was airing. I don't think it's really the same anymore. But like. Yeah, this, this guy enjoys sports because, like, obviously, if you play sports and if you have those, like, core fundamental memories playing sports as a kid in school and you watch animes like this, this shit makes you cry. It moves you. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Oh, Chainsaw Man getting some slander right now. Why is Chainsaw Man mid? Oh, come on. These are bullshit reasons, bro. Dude, every one of these people on the streets, they have some hot takes immediately on what animes they call out, but the logic is trash. Like, of course it's grotesque. That's the whole premise of this shit. Like, you're not the target on. You need to tell me that, like, something funny like Power is a trash waifu because she doesn't wipe her ass after shitting in the toilet. She doesn't even flush the toilet. And you guys are losers for glazing up Power. See, if someone went out and said that and shit on Chainsaw Man, Man I would think based. I would think funny. But this is like, I don't like grotesque scenes. What did you expect? It's called Chainsaw Man. What is it trying to convey to the viewers? I think that Chainsaw Man gets this kind of criticism because Chainsaw Man is just such a. It's just such an experience. I don't know how to put it into words. It's just wacky and crazy. It has this weird, quirky vibe that I cannot feel from different animes. I, I can understand what she's trying to say here. That's the entire thing, huh? Every time people shit on Demon Slayer, the logic is always so many people hype it up, and I try to get in there, but I just can't get into it. It is just this like expectations that is too hype, and then people try to go in with this crazy expectation set up. And then they get disappointed due to a generic shonen plot without being able to get to the hype episodes where the battle's action really shines through. That's why Demon Slayer gets the, the, the shit, bro. ブルーロックです。Why?Why?Blue?絵が綺麗っていうか、絵だけで伝わってくるのがすごい面白いなと思って。Okay, she likes the animation, but Chainsaw Man animation was great. You know what I think? You know what I she I think she just likes to look at a bunch of femboys and just bot just like bodysuit spandex running around being all sweaty. That's what I think is going on here. Tell me what you really feel about Blue Lock. You didn't give me an explanation. You said that you just like the style of conveying things so through Nah, you just like looking at a bunch of dudes in spandex. Me too. Made in Abyss. Based. This girl shit on Demon Slayer and then says Made in Abyss is underrated. I like her. Dude, she's great. Like, this is pretty good, man. I think that Made in Abyss, is it underrated though? A lot of people talk about the show. Maybe not to the degree of shows like Jujutsu Kaisen and Demon Slayer, huh? Made in Abyss, if you haven't seen it, you gotta check it out. And go in there with, like, you need to steal your resolve before you go into Made in Abyss. Or maybe you shouldn't, because the uh, <laughs> the uh, anime only experience I heard when this shit was airing, nobody knew what was going on. Everyone thing was like, oh, cute kids, adventuring, so wholesome. And then episode 10 happens, <laughs> and people are like, oh, oh. <laughs> and then you get to see the true despair that is made in Abyss. かなって思いますね。結構グロいの大好きで、そのグロさもあるし、ストーリー性も結構感動する感じで、最初は絶対面白くないなと思って見てたけど、後々えめっちゃいいストーリーです。いつの間にかないてたりとか。Wow。Even the way that she explained her logic and why it's good makes sense as well. This is probably one of the best interviewers so far. Interviewees. してみちゃいましたね。やはり一番好きなアニメ。The author loves to make those children suffer. Yes, and that's the weird shit. The author... Okay. 
I don't know how true this is, but I heard that the author has a literal torso of a middle school girl in his room studio as a prop. That's the kind of guy that you're working with. And, and when, I was, when I read that, when I found that out, I don't know how true it is. I was like, you know what? That makes a lot of sense. If you've actually seen Made in the Abyss, I'm like, yeah, I would expect a guy that writes shit like this to have something like that. The things that he... The violence and the gore of the depiction of children, it's... <laughs> I'm just afraid that he's going to be caught as a PDF file before the story ends. That, that's what I'm afraid of. Thank you, Kevin, for the six month of Prime, and I, I thank you so much. Lord of Mystery trailer? <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> it's been two years and people are still fucking begging for Lord of Mystery's anime trailer. Listen, if it's not fucking new, I'm not going to react to it. オッケー。1番だったらどっち、どっち。IQ。どっちか、どっちか。コナンの方が好きです。レインでは推理だけど、恋愛もあるし、友情もあるし、こう家族愛もあるし、すごい喜怒哀楽が表現されてて面白いな
bro was in band and was in volleyball club. Both double dipping and Hibiki and Haiku nostalgia. Yeah. Alright, we're stopping it there, bro. We have to watch Haiku one of these days. Can we not? Why are you guys like this? Type 1 in chat for Haikyuu, type 2 for no. And don't lie to me. Just give me your honest feelings. I know it's gonna be a bunch of twos, bro. Why are you like this? Why can't we watch Haikyuu, bro? The Haikyuu numbers are insane. People type... People love this show. And you guys just wanna eat garbage isekai every single day? Can we not watch Haikyuu one of these days? Please. Please, get me out of isekai hell. Please. Can we get into the Haikyuu? Fuck, I don't know. Anyways, that's part three. We'll be ending this series with part four on the next video. So many twos right now. Fuck you guys, man.